Hi there and welcome back to Tyranny. Oh, let's play. Let's start the action. Right. We're in here. This is Jacob the Lord Red. And our motto is <laughs> it's Judgment Day and we are the Lord. We're just starting the gameplay. Let's go. Uh, do we need the tooltips? I thought I just deactivated them. Kairos, the overlord, be praised. When I heard the avalanche, I feared the valley was sealed with you. On the other side, the disfavored warrior claps her gauntlet to her breastplate. The traditional salute of her legion. The commander wouldn't say why the governor of Lithian's crossing would be coming. But since we have no forges here, I imagine you are here to knock some sense into the voices of Nerat. She catches herself clearing her throat with a smile. I mean, mediate with the Archons, so that we might agree on a plan to wipe out these Oath-Breakers. Oh, the Tearsman. I come bearing an Edict of Kairos. Our soldiers will complete their task or die. Will we do that? Yeah, we'll do that. The Edict is leveled against us, Aurora says. Her eyes widen with fear, her posture slackens, but the Scarlet Chorus prevents us from taking action. Why would the Overlord punish both of... She clears her throat with a sigh. Forgive me. It is not my place to question. We should have conquered the enemy within weeks of arriving in the valley. The delay reflects poorly on all of us. Uh, hmm. We'll just glare silently, or... Oh? That's, that's threatening enough. I mean, we're not a man of, of enough wit, but we are a man of will. <laughs> we'll glare at her. We'll need to do this. Aurora eases back from you ever so slightly. I gather I'm not required to know such things. She studies your face, smiling nervously as she fails to discern your signals. Oh, I learn things when it's time for me to know. You know what? Forget I asked. Well, you've traveled a long way. I won't keep you further, I'm sure. The Archons will want to hear from you at... Her voice falls silent, her attention snapping eastward with alarm. Did you hear that? More runners! Third tier time this week. The Oathbreakers keep trying to send messengers through the mountains to gather help from outside the valley. She points over to the collapse path by which you arrived. But they're a bit too late for that now. Come, let's show these Oathbreakers a good fight. Yeah, definitely. Let's, let's show them. We can thrust them. We can use a shield slam. Yeah, let's let's use that shield slam. I got it. Bam. And now here I got it. flank this guy. Let's thrust. Protect. Come on. What else do we have? We have Sunder. <laughs> Reduce the armor. Yeah. Bam. There we go. Warriors respite. <laughs> Do less damage. Oh, it's really like a yeah. There's one down. Check. Let's check further along the path for more. But um, I think there was someone standing here at the start as well. Avalanche has blocked. I think if we could fit through the rubble. Uh, I'm not sure, but I saw someone here. Something. Let's see. We can also go this way, strangely. What's this? Jump down. 28 athletics. We have pretty good athletics, so... Uh, gain a wound. No, we jump down. There is something here. I'm sure we can take something here. Let's see. Abandoned memorial, bronze talk, corrode bronze talk, sits atop the shrine, examine talk. Talk possesses a number of small grooves, it otherwise appears fairly ordinary. Sorry, can't. That wasn't so hard. There's a little pass here. Ha. And some cheese, very nice. Can't do that. That was all. That was all. Yeah. Always pays off. Take these. Um, yeah, detours. Oh, look. 
<laughs> nice. <laughs> like the Madonna's. It's, this, this is bleeding from the eyes. Squeeze through gap. No, we're not we're not the one to squeeze, we're strong. Let's move the boulder. Press your weight against the boulder directly in your palm. Like it starts to <laughs> root strength will also I got it. Work. Yes. What do we have here? What, what should we start with? A shield slam is always good, right? Let's start with a shield slam. Let's thunder them. And let's thrust to the end. Combinations. combinations. Flanking we'll do. I hope that's flanking in this game. I mean, it's like Pillars of Eternity from the combat system again, so... On it! There should be flanking, too. Uh, double thunder now. Oh god! This guy has been killed. Yeah, we're not doing much damage. Couldn't win faster. <laughs> More to loot, right? More to loot. These guys. Shattered Iron Sword. Ah, not good. Sun Soldier's Javelin. Huh. I mean, that seems better than our weapon. Let's take all. Let's look at the inventory. Uh, we have... We have the bronze sword. We have a bronze spear. Party stash, let's see. Weapons. Yeah, that should be better here, right? That in the party stash, and that's a quick Sun Soldier's Javelin. What's going on here? So many dead people. Maybe we shouldn't have taken it all, right? Several skulls bleached by the sun, picked clean by carrion birds. Spiked on a roughly hewn post. It is the only heraldry the Scarlet Forest needs. Here's someone. Oh god. Try and catch me, worm. She's of the Scarlet Chorus. We don't like the Scarlet Chorus, but they are on our side, so we'll help her. Try and catch me, worm! A young Scarlet Fury weaves around the Vendrian Guard attackers, avoiding their weapons with fluid grace. She nods to acknowledge you. A breathless enemy soldier passes a glance to a countryman. This one's crazy. Too much lead in her water. We could cut our losses and turn back. Ha! Ah, fate Binder. You're here at last. Care to join me in putting these cowards out of their misery? Um... Depends. Who are you? No. Um... She's clearly from our side, so we'll have to save, save her. Join the battle. Save something for me. For the realm of Apex, charge the Vendrian Guard to level their weapons and advance. Ha! Uh, we'll have to help her. She's attacking this guy. So let's assist. Blood soaked stone. Coordinate with worse to knock your target prone and follow up. With strong bleeding attack. Await my signal! Run! <laughs> Bam. Pro. Now let's thunder. <laughs> Kill this guy very quickly. Oh, she's in danger a bit. Now, what about a thrust? Can't do that. Now let's let's get this guy off her. This guy is soon dead, so we we'll go over here. Yes, right. And shield slam him. Stop his actions. And thunder. I like this this combination. So Scouting out by your ass! Combat. Interesting. Whew. I can tell you didn't spend the conquest in a diplomat's tent. 
Pathfinder surveys the fresh corpses in the north with such I'm verse, by the way. But there are more important things to take care of than introductions. Those Vendrian guard we killed didn't come alone. Ah, do you do we want to travel with her? I don't know. Maybe it's it's good to have her around, but she's from the Scarlet Chorus and we're not really fond of the of the Scarlet Chorus, so you're dismissed, soldier. If I need you, I'll find you at the Scarlet Chorus. Is Chorus that a camp. jest? If you want to wander off on your own and die, so be it. But I was ordered to protect you. Well, if there's an order, fine. Stick with me, follow my lead. I don't make it my business to question orders. I've done things that would make the hairs on your backside prickle. Uh, too much information. A smile full of memory spreads across her face like a stain. For the voices of Nerat! Rose furrows her brow and focuses down on the battle to come. Now, let's take... Let's take stuff. What do we have? A Scarlet Fury helmet. It's a broken helmet and a hide. We can already upgrade. That's pretty good. Let's go. Let's see. We have... What is it? Accessory? No. It's... Go for that helm. God, we're, we're looking like... No, that, that doesn't look orderly. We need a fate by the helm. We need a disfavored helm. Let's give her the Scarlet Fury helm. This cannot stand, I mean. What's here? An empty spike stands waiting to claim its victim. Let's continue. Weapons and armor are strewn haphazardly around the card. Every blade shows signs of rust and every piece of armor is in need of repair. And here, several skulls bleached by the sun and picked clean by carrion birds are spiked on a roughly hewn post. It is the only heraldry that Scarlet Chorus needs. Disgusting. This chaos. Who are you guys? Tarkis Demos. Eyes forward, no looking back. The Vendrian Guard warrior roars with his faults held high. His words largely lost over the din of combat. Stand aside or your funeral will be over the side of the bluff. Seeing you squarely in his path, the soldier points his weapon your way. Are you? You're from the Vendrian Guard. Uh, well, um, they're oath breakers, but we should give them to the law. So I applaud your bravery, but I implore you. End this foolishness and lay down your arms, because it's Judgment Day and we are the law. Not a chance. If I surrender, I'm as good as dead. As you are, but you're saving yourself a lot of suffering, Tarkis Demas. At least we can drag some of Kairos' chosen along our short journey to the void. We'll see about that. As he signals his men to charge, the sound of chanting rises from the south, drawing his attention. Scarlet Chorus reinforcements, hurry! guy from the Scarlet Chorus. Run down the Oathbreakers, let no one escape. From the red mob of reinforcements from the south, a blood chant emerges the head of the rebel. The ornamental crest of her staff pulsing with crimson tones, signing signals of magic and wordlessly moving her mouth at the blood chanter, scribes a series of spells into the air. A red glow surrounds the Vendrian guard warriors as the chanter's magic warms its way into their minds blinding them with rage. Hold position, all of you. You there, keep to the path. The warrior gestures along the canyon trail, but his soldiers turn their attention to the Scarlet Chorus roaring challenges. No, don't engage them. We need to run, his orders falling on deaf ears. The warrior reluctantly readies his weapon. So it's a fire. Hope you fancy red. Who is that? A bastion? That, that seems like a boss. Let's attack him first. We'll shield slam this guy. And she can... What can she do? She has red geyser stance. 
What does she do? She has skewer, burning iron, or a burning arrow. Yeah, let's let's go for the burning arrow on this. <laughs> We need to be ready to use the warrior's respite. And worse should definitely uh, go with blood sucks, soaks stone, right? Thunder treatment to ah, sorry and she can go for yeah, she'll just yeah. all good shield slam <laughs> Have him down in no time. Uh, we're below 50%, I think. Oh, we need to do this. Warrior's respite. Let's kill him. Let's kill that guy here. Triple throw, burning iron. Let's, let's oh. flank. Flank the enemy. Son of guy. Coordinate. Ah. We can tell. We're the queen! We're wounded. I tear your Game's hard a bit. So. Don't melt by your ass! Guys. The other chorus guys. Oh, there's a, an honor guard. Look at that. Three of these chorus guys and two of them already dead. What are they? The bosses! Or oh, something like that. Come on. You got it. Oh, oh. oh. Yeah, well done. Well done, that last thing. Who is coming here? Crescent Runner. Oh, of the disfavored. That's that's our guy. Come quick, we have a situation on the cliffside. They have the commander. All things going astray here. All things bad. Let's take the Horde Bracers definitely, and we'll equip them as well. Let's see. Horde Bracers. What do we have here? Fate Binder Gloves. Horde Bracers are just better. Right. And you will have nothing. All right. Commander's Will. Ah, better boots. Well then. Nice going. What, what do you have for boots? Pretty good boots. Alright, so. Uh, we'll continue this run in the next episode. We'll save the commander, of course. Happy gaming to you, and see you in the next episode. Uh, don't forget, it's Judgment Day, and we are the law.